How was that? I don't know. Because it's saying it's saying nine years ago, but I don't believe it's nine years ago. Maybe it was uploaded. Yeah, maybe it was uploaded nine years ago. Because I feel in high school. I feel like I was in primary school, so it would make sense if I was in class eight and you were in high school. Yes, I was in high school. I was in class three. I love that. Sisi <laughs> 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 Okay, okay. Because uh, you guys let us know triple one triple four <laughs> triple one is the SMS line. You know how we begin the show. We have to give us the hottest tea in town. It's time for Pop Spot. Yes, and I do have the first story, and it is about um, Joe Mushiri. We all know that he used to work for Capital FM for, I think, over a decade or just about a decade before, you know, he resigned. And, you know, he has recently come out to talk about why he did not congratulate um, Larry Madow well, when everyone else was doing that about, you know, his new job with CNN. And this is what he had to say. Uh, Manz sent an email to my former employee asking them to fire me. Yani, a whole adult, sent an email saying that a person like me should not be working at Capital FM just because I made fun of him. I made fun of him here. Now he's talking about Instagram because this is where he was talking about it. Uh, because, uh, because I made fun of him here. Luckily, the manager was not these new managers who just fire people for, ro for no reason to look cool online. He asked me, Joe, now who is this Larry person? I told him it's just some big mouth on Twitter. Mm, he put in parentheses. You and your brackets. Such and say two brackets. Mm -hmm. um, literally. Uh, he's, he's just some big mouth on Twitter, literally, who just doesn't like me. Um, he then told me, can you tell these people online to stop uh, sending me nonsense? Because apparently other people used to chomea me to him. So he said, you know, he continued to talk about it a little bit more, but he said he can, he can, he cannot respect someone who's trying to um, block someone's bag. You know, you never know what that person wants to do with that money. You know, that's that's basically all he said. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There's it's a part I, I, I saw mm -hmm. that he said uh, most people know Larry, the good Larry, but mm -hmm. don't know the, the other, other side. side of Larry, mm -hmm. which he has met, we haven't. Mm -hmm. But. Also, if you made fun of him, it's mm -hmm. not really a good thing. I mean, if he had, like, like you can email your boss, another boss to, to yeah. let them. I don't think I'd want them mm -hmm. to get fired. No, of though. course not. Of course not. <laughs> but also, what are we at fault? Let's be honest. Mm -hmm. Because why is he poking fun at him? Yeah. Like, why is he poking him? To, you know why to I don't react? feel like he's at fault? Yeah. Because I kind of also like poke fun at people, yeah. but I don't expect them to write an email for me to get fired. At the end of the day, you're blocking someone's bag, man. Why would you do that? Yeah. Unless they unless that. they have uh, insulted you I'd or like... I'd love to know unless, the intensity yeah, of, of the what joke. Exactly, yeah. of what he joked about. Yeah, because if yeah. it's like something like that is sexual harassment, because these days, even someone calling you sexy at work is sexual harassment, that I can understand yeah. you writing an email and being like he's being inappropriate yeah. but like a polite joke here or there i don't think it's a reason for someone to lose their bag yeah honestly well, like you know like at the end of the day we all have our demons and like mm -hmm. he says you know we've not seen the other side of larry yeah. well and good the same thing where we appear to not you are i'm not being specific um i'm not saying this specifically mm -hmm. because of joe mm -hmm. but i'm like you know we all have our vices and our evil mm -hmm. things That's we have true. done things and yet where we maybe exactly so i i feel like at the end of the day it's more of you know who decides to do what next mm -hmm. you know who mm -hmm. decides to you know take action and all that yeah because now if and atacha tuni seme tu i think atani shot and kitu rataka kusema Unajua, whether you congratulate someone because they're winning or, or not, not. It, they're born, it doesn't affect. But it's because people were asking him. Thing. They were like, how come you've not congratulated him? How come you've not congratulated mm. him? That's why he addressed it. Oh. It's not like he was out here like, oh, this is why I didn't. Me, I can't congratulate. No, guys kept asking him, why didn't you congratulate him? Yeah. So he addressed but I feel it. Like yeah, exactly. yeah. As in personally, for me, I only did it up a big show. But he went at the O's, Jun and Dika's figures. Maybe they had a friendship before and people realized it was up, like what's going on. Or maybe yeah. they yeah. did have a friendship. Yeah. And that's where 
the problem is. Because yeah. when you guys become friends, then you mm. sort of, I always say this, I honestly don't want to meet my mentor. Because I don't want to see his weakness. Yeah, you don't want to see weakness. the bad side yeah, of I them. Don't want, yeah. let, let me just remind, remain that good you know the, the clueless, good features and clueless yeah. of, of how what how mm -hmm. they are in person mm. but i don't want to know their weaknesses yeah. I, i'll feel bad yeah. you know i'll yeah. be like gosh is that what i am looking up yeah. but i think for? now that takes us back to mm. you see sometimes you uphold people at very, high, very standards. high standards yeah. forgetting they're also human maybe you just don't know mm. what um the bad things that they do yeah how many things are uh, okay, to Lele and Kelly. Yeah, yeah. 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 stories that came la, la, la. out. Yeah. Me, yeah. I was heartbroken. Yeah. I was like, hey, the way I used to sing to I'm this song. I'm telling you to date. I hear an R. Kelly song. I start singing. I'm like, oh, no. You exactly. <laughs> now, you see what I'm saying? Everyone has an evil side. So sometimes, by the yeah. time, who are role model? Yeah. You get, yeah. do yeah. your own thing, mind yeah. your own, whatever. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And also, when it comes to friendships, mm -hmm. then mm -hmm. don't the word karma is not back. a good word. But you know, sometimes it's what you put out in the world that comes back to you, either directly, indirectly. Directly. through your friends yeah. through people you thought you knew yeah. through different things yeah. let me just yeah let me you. just close by saying this mm. me personally as Joyce Minor me I, I don't hide about the fact that me in a debate may I catch feelings. If you roast me, I will catch feelings. But I'll quickly get over it. Yeah. I won't hold it over your head and try to get you fired. Yeah. That's just how I feel and I'm telling you as someone who has been roasted before and I I would like I got feelings. Yeah. You know, but yeah. I let it go. Because yeah. you know that's important to, to me anyway. Me. Yeah. Like literally from Kitambo yeah. we've been on the same tables, we've worked together. Yeah. And they've made fun of me since I started music to yeah. write stuff. Unajeli wali anza kiona ni jokes. Now see God. See God. They start for that for yeah wana ku ongele leven yon attacka cause on any jokes on it's funny at that time. Then the God changes the situation in a qua. Now you respect me because what I have done. You get now you want to be buddies and all that. His will is planned. I God. think squeeze it to you. We can have a little too much. We can have memory pop spot yeah, stories. We are just popping like that. Anyway, popping. Guys, yeah. Let, let me take you <laughs> guys to the next story, and of course, netizens and KOT especially, KOT came off mad. They were act by a statement that Marini Natural CEO Miss Michelle Talami posted that she wanted some favors, and one of the favors was she was looking for photographers for her birthday mm -hmm. a shoot that she's having and she was looking for photographers she was looking for makeup artists shoe brands outfits jewelry stores hairstylists and even hotels to partner with her on her upcoming birthday right so she said she's gonna pay back by exposure and that did not sit well with so many people especially uh, on netizens on social media so in a quick rejoinder she also one of the goja kwanza this is what some of them said, Atani get Izo screenshots. I was like, wow. Mm -hmm. um, say, Mom, I personally don't see any problem with that. what she said. The problem with most people is they never see any value in others. She's a premium brand. She knows it. She looks out for herself. You would probably do the same if you were in her position. But then one was like, she's offering vanity metrics in exchange of the actual products and services. What a shame. Now, in a quick <laughs> rejoinder, she joined Instagram and addressed the nation. And she said, the queen is here. And she gave her two cents. So this is what she says. It is a pro bono shoot for all the brands. And I believe... Uh, and um, Goja, and, uh, and Goja. It's a pro bono shoot for all the brands and people I will partner with. This is no charges. I only get to keep the items that I like or whatever you choose to bless me with from your collection. I've already got the concept, so I need it. All I need is the awesome team and brands to put it together. Okay, so or say Kenyans got triggered and, and she addressed them saying, listen, I'm only willing to work with people who are willing to work with me under my conditions. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. And where what wa make sirika sana na Michelle Talami first she said that being said my job is not to convince you. I don't know if this is an apology, a press statement Allah. or whatever you may, you can let us know triple one triple four triple one. Nakasema that being said my job is not to convince you that I truly want to support other brands. My purpose is to try and shed some light to you on meaningful business collaborations. Most people were excited excited and inspired by my post, but some were triggered. The ones mm. who are triggered, quite frankly, have a lot to work to a lot of work to do. The ones who are inspired have grasped the concept of collaboration, brand brand value, and accelerated growth. I'm not perfect, but in my career, 
basically it's a long rant mm -hmm. telling you why she chose to uh, partner with other brands who are willing to to do it under her terms mm. basically you get exposure and she gets the items or whatever but mm. that's the story guys me like <laughs> i think i heard about this the day it went viral and yeah. we were talking about it and i said at the end of the day there are brands that are going to work with her. Ata uonge aje, ata umbash aje. At the end of the at the day, she's a big brand in Kenya, and there are people who've been dying to work with her. And to be quite honest, we don't know your photo shoot. There are, there are going to be so many brands that will be willing to work with her under her conditions. Mm. So if you're not happy about it, because you're not probably not one of those brands that yeah. she's trying to work with. You yeah. get what I mean? Yeah. I'm like, I know the exposure part of things in Dunakwanga, the hardest for people to unajua kukubali, especially kama say when we're in times where mm. COVID hit, people yeah. are not making money, mm -hmm. people are struggling to make ends meet and all that. But you know, at the end of the day, I think it's how she stated it mm -hmm. that yeah. was the problem. Mm -hmm. No guys had a problem with the exposure. Exactly. Yeah. 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 Like you, I think it's how when you state you are, oh, yeah. the pro that's what triggered people. Mm -hmm. You know, like, eh? mm -hmm. you know, exposure, yeah. you get exposure, yeah. you get. But maybe I'm going to be different. Yeah. Yeah. Kwa, collaboration or something. Exactly. You get a whole different situation. But I'm like, at the end of the day, sometimes you need to recognize an opportunity when it shows itself. You get but you think you can deliver then you just do something small and let us see what you to corner one two three people will see you yeah. they maybe decide to work with you yeah. then after that other people see you from these to kidogo people who saw you mm. then they decide to work with you mm. so at the end of the day it's like a 50 50 thing yeah. you either yeah. say that you yeah. want it or you don't you get yeah. the same thing kitu kuna mtu kuzia no let me use the la kushikwa lines mm. kuna mtu atanishuka hizi lines na 500 mm. kuna msa atanishuka na 25 mm. yeah. kuna msa atasema ni thao yeah. so at the end of the day kuna mwingine atasema na try kujifunza kukua mm. kuiba acha nikufanye for free But. so at the end of the day it depend what do you want as a person yeah. if you don't mm. want to go to the free things mm -hmm. go and pay yeah. so it's all about yeah. your priorities and what you want yeah. so it's yeah. not a must like yeah. at the end of the day yeah. it's not a must You're not to work forced. with someone exactly. yeah. exposure yeah. where acha dana hiyo hapo no no let me tell you when you go to the market There are yeah. people looking for onions. Exactly. There are others looking for mm. uh, tomatoes. Mm -hmm. If you're looking for exposure, then you know this you will is find the it. right yeah. place to go to. She yeah. wants to give you the exposure. And let's not lie, mm. we, we, we do digital marketing. That's true. And we know we charge per post on the feed. Mm -hmm. we, we charge on the Insta mm -hmm. stories. But if I want something and you have it, yeah. but you are, wi you are willing to give me the product so mm -hmm. that I can market for you, mm -hmm. then I have already paid my dues yeah. by marketing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We agree on how many deliverables I have to give you mm -hmm. and for the for the said amount, mm -hmm. most, most people Especially Most people. of those brands can't exactly, afford that, her. Exactly, yeah. you cannot. If I tell you right now mm. to make me a dress, and that dress you tell me, e dress um, ni 20k. Mm. Sawa? Mm. E dress ni 20k unanuzia, yeah. sindiyo? But kama mimi ni kukupost kwa page yako, ni 50k, ni 50K <laughs> on the feed, <laughs> that means what? <laughs> But because I need it, nita yeah. kufanya na nita ku advertise yeah, that I have done the part yeah. of the deal. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah. That's, and like, like, like Michelle has done some awesome photo shoots. As I, I might be a bit biased here, but she's done some amazing photo shoots yeah. that That have gone viral and being on her set, you're going to be treated well. Mm. She's not just going to let you come alafu kai to ata akupati imaji, akupati food. You know yeah. what I mean? So, when you're na, the ones who want to benefit from this exposure, they, you guys benefit. Au ingina wako kachi kachi tu feelings. Wako kachi tu shabi yako. Kachi tu mpatake pesa uko kwa watu enyo atawalipa, you know. Like, yeah. it's, sometimes it's not yours, so you don't need to actually react or mm. comment. Unagia, yeah. tunazatu move on, so that mtu wako interested, ashugulike na yo. Yeah. But anyway, let me take you guys to the next story of which.